What is up, everyone? Welcome back to another video, and today we are back reacting to Jet Lag the Game's Race to Circumnavigate the Globe in 100 Hours. If you don't remember what happened last time, then I'll give you a quick refresh here. Pretty much, the way this works is that two teams start in Colorado, and they're starting, I think, Colorado, and their goal is to make their way back to Colorado, but going across the world. They, they have only have $1,000 to spend, and $1,000 to spend, and they have to complete challenges to earn more money so they can buy more flights. Last time, what I remember, there was some huge like delay issue that screwed up one of the team's plans. I think they might go over this stuff at the beginning of the video, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So anyway, please remember to like and subscribe. Remember that one that if we get that sweet one thousand subscribers, then you will get a glorious face. You get a face reveal, and just continue up the support. This the the the, cha the support the channel has gotten recently has just been amazing. Subscribe. My subscriber count has gone up a little bit, and I, I am, thank you, every single one of you, for doing this, for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. Anyway, with all of that out of the way, let's get to it. Right now, we're racing to circumnavigate the world. Both teams started in Denver with one thousand dollars, and we earn more money by doing challenges. We're one day in, that. so if you haven't watched episode one, there are about to be some spoilers. Me and Joseph just took off from Cancun to Amsterdam, meaning we're sure, going to be right. the first team to arrive in Europe. Ben yeah, and I are in New York, that. about to board a flight to Milan. The route from mm -hmm. Milan to Thailand just fell apart due to delays, so they're boarding their flight to Italy with mm -hmm. no plan at all. Right. All right, well, our Thailand passes. Yeah, their flight got delayed. This flight got delayed, so they couldn't. They didn't have time to get to the next flight. We got approved. Moments after our Thailand plan fell apart. Incredible. <laughs> So, imagine what would happen if they ended up taking the exact same plane. Imagine how weird that would be. We're really confused about what Sam and Joseph are up to. I mean, it's it's been like twelve hours. Is there already on a plane? No challenges. They haven't completed any challenges. So, hopefully, cut to them doing some really huge ambitious <laughs> challenge right now. Nope, they're on a plane. Somewhere over the Atlantic, actually. E. They're checking their carbon out output. Okay. All right, our microphone like word. Right. So if we sound worse, that's one. Okay. Sorry. I don't know. Absolutely massive update. I I don't know how we didn't see this flight. Um, there is a 1:50 p.m. direct from Milan to Singapore. Ooh. Six hundred ninety-six dollars. That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money, but it's but we would cheap. have. You know, four hours to try to earn it. And if we can yeah, four, money, yeah. That seems like enough time to get the, the money. Complete the challenges. Actually, I'm kind of curious. If someone completes a challenge, do the, uh, does it like lock for the other team? Can they like not do it anymore? Or they all have their own separate challenge list? It's time for these special boys to have yeah. their dinner. I say, those airplane meals, not the greatest. I ate one. And I just didn't like it at all. I don't know. This must must be like it just barely meets requirements or something. I don't I don't know what's wrong. Why? Maybe maybe it's like the, the setting or something. Because for some reason, we just think the food tastes bad or something. I don't know, but from what my experience is, it tastes bad. All right, we finally made out of customs. Yep. Perfect. Took a really nice close look at Joseph's passport. Got a little hassle. I have a brand new passport that only has one stamp on it from Mexico from yesterday. So. Yeah. <laughs> Which looks a little it's, sus. It's a little sus. Okay, so now we need to decide what we're doing. I mean, definitely go do a challenge. I feel like the museum one would be pretty easy. Is it either that one museum? or the top five attraction. Take a photo of the top five landmarks. Okay. okay. That's pretty high value. I'm going to read. I'm gonna read the one they actually do because I'm pretty sure they're gonna bring it up. The Reichs Museum, the Van Gogh Museum. Which are right next they're to they're each all other. pretty close. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, that one's how much that, is that one, one has more money. That one's worth like less than nine hundred bucks. Oh well, let's just do that one. Okay, so we're gonna take a photo at your city's top five landmarks. In this challenge, top five landmarks are defined as the five most popular attractions on TripAdvisor. That have been, that have at least one thousand reviews may only travel by public transit, no taxis or ride sharing allowed. The photo must be taken within at least five hundred feet of each attraction, and if accept if a 
applicable at least one photo must be taken in the attraction after gaining admission. Got it. Now we all know. That's pretty high value on nice the Nice little show, yeah. actually. Yeah, if, it's all, if they're all like right next to each other, we need to snipe that before they get, the, get it in the lawn. Let's, let's, uh, let's get a train to the city then. Yeah, once the challenge is complete, it's all limited for the air. Right, oh, yeah, because that one is public transport only, I think. Yeah, that, we can do it. Yeah, because they haven't even arrived yet. Good morning, Ben. Buongiorno. Oh, buongiorno. Welcome to Italy. Mamma mia. Mamma mia. I love much to be for you have to brush your teeth in the airport bathroom. <laughs> Weird. While we were on the plane, we looked at a ton of options. We had all these different plans. We, you know, we originally wanted to go Paris to Bangkok, but then we missed the Paris flight. We actually got in after it even left. Then we were thinking we would go to London and then Singapore, but then we realized we were idiots. The flight typically costs around two thousand six hundred dollars with two tickets, which is why Ben and I have considered it before. But today, two tickets cost nineteen hundred. And there's a direct flight from Milan to Singapore at one fifty p.m. We just need to earn a ton of money. Yeah, that's the problem. We have to earn a lot of money. And so the best way to do that is going to be by building a go kart. Building a what? Build and ride a go kart for twelve hundred. That is exactly what you need. I only have three hundred dollars to do it. But you must build a go kart with at least four wheels, and one team member must ride it for at least hundred feet down a hill without it falling apart. No pre-built wagons, carts, or frames. Wheels on it on an axle are acceptable. We we put the go kart challenge on there like last minute, sort of as a joke. We did not think anyone was gonna do it. We did a ton of research on the plane. We've looked at like yeah every single hardware store near the airport. We have found one that sells wheels. I've done so much research about wheels. I now know the Italian word for wheels. It's Round dough. No, that Rutan. can't be right. I don't know the Italian word for wheels. Uh, but we're going to Brico it. Center, and we're going to attempt to buy everything we need to build a go kart. Got some caffeine. Mm. So it looks like we have to visit the Rijks Museum, Rijks Museum. the Vondel Park, the Anne Frank Museum, Anne Frank the Van Gogh Museum, Museum. Yeah. and the Anne Frank Museum. Yeah. Sorry, not the Van Gogh Museum. The, the Jordan, which is right next to the... That's all. The Anne Frank Museum Jordan. Yes, the Jordan and the Anne Frank Museum are right next to each other, and the three others are right next yeah, to each other. Yeah, we do that really easily. Yeah. But if, is there two Anne Frank Museums? Because it was mentioned twice. <laughs> oh. Ciao. Oh. All right, baby, we are at the Brico Center. Yeah, it's everyone's like favorite reason to come to Italy. We need wheels. So they got two hours to build and ride a go kart. They must do it. Something like this would be good. Like that's enough. To you could pretty much just like put four wheels on like a wood plank, attach them to the plank, and then just roll it down a hill and sit in. To ride on. They've got a whole wheel section here. Oh, oh, oh. Those red ones are pretty sick, huh? Let's go bigger. Bigger? That's gonna cost more money. I need 300 bucks. Now we're gonna need screws to screw that onto there. Stick up through the wood a little bit. It's fine. Boy, I sure hope they're not doing this right now. <laughs> no, they're not. They're taking the bus to a museum. We've made it to the Anne Frank house. Famous for being the uh, house of Anne Frank. Yep, that's right. No, it's Anne Frank's house. Is it and not actually museum. her house? I don't know. They've updated it. I, I feel like you're not supposed to renovate they historic, they, they, yeah, they historic renovate. landmarks. Maybe if they're in the right, Let me only do some Googling. There we go. Okay. And Frank is all right, now we, need, now we need to find the Jordan, which I think is really just this neighborhood. So let's go down there and turn right. Okay, so attraction one out of five done. We got to make pace because I think there's a good chance that Ben and Adam are trying to do this right I, now, I think too. They're, yeah, they're building a go kart for 300 bucks. Could I sit in that? Could you sit in that? Was there requirements that I had to seat? I think the requirements yeah. just have to have four wheels. I think that was the only requirement. I know they you have to weigh them. Weigh them? Yes. Where? In, in the bottom. You have to weigh them. 
Sounds like you're ready to build a go kart, buddy. Yeah, but where? <laughs> what a great question. Pick up the pace. Go in the parking lot. <laughs> so this is gonna be a challenge. I have no idea what the Jordan is or why it's an attraction. I don't either. It's like a neighborhood, I guess, and it looks nice, but it kind of also just looks like the rest of the Amsterdam. The sign says Jordan, therefore in Jordan. So if you're like pur purposely pushing your chin in. Okay. Logistic force. That's 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 when Wendover gets its own private army. We're gonna call yeah. it the logistic force. It's looking for train mm. nineteen. Train nineteen. Train nineteen. It leaves like now o'clock. Everything comes down to this epic movement. Epic, epic music starts now. This one tram. This one tram. If we don't make this tram, we give up right now, right? right yeah, what? We're, we get into a nice what? hotel and sleep. Damn it! We made our tram. We made it. I guess we have to keep trying. <laughs> All right. We have about, two hours. This what, like flight. an hour and a half max to yeah. build a go kart? We gotta go quick. Oh, yeah. Stiamo construendo. Ooh, go kart. What? Is that? Is we gotta speed run this. Yeah, I know. Either this is gonna be an epic sequence of competing to finish this at the same. Well, Ben and Adam are doing this, or we're gonna look like idiots. Yeah, either we're way. gonna look like idiots. We're out of here. Well, they look more like idiots because they're the ones doing the choke challenge. Here's the Rikes Museum. Three, two, one, smile. Two left. Okay, we got it. Got that one. All right, uh, Van Gogh Museum, that's that, right? It rolls. It looks very dangerous. Oh, it's very dangerous. Okay. Three, two, one, smile. That's one left. One left is Volnder Park. We gotta, we gotta go north. It's like this way. All right. That's the sea? Man, look at how intermodal this street is. Keep walking. No, I'm not. I'm talking. I'm walking and talking. Yeah. Walking. All right. Did they just... What? What is this in the front? Fondel Park. Let's go. Quick selfie, 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 quick. Quickly, 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 quickly. They got lucky. Go, 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 go. Wow. On the pack, they got their money. How long is it completed? Nice job. Only right, have... Joseph, what's, what's your prediction of what they're going to right now? We call it the Mamma Mia. Italian man right there, Adam. Don't be insensitive. That's not insensitive, is it? We just have to find somewhere to ride this thing. No. Let's go. And how are you going to ride it? Are you going to spit in the bucket? Go it's it's good good yeah. Should we go visit the U.S. consulate? Yeah, let's go Thanks do it. Money. Visit the U.S. consulate. What is this? You might not use your phone or the internet to look up where your local consulate is. We only travel for hundreds of public transit, no taxis or rides are allowed. What is a consulate? Yeah, let's make some money. You know, remember for, for our second The second challenge complete in the same location as the previous location, less than 300 miles away, is worth half its value. Subsequent challenges. So I was going to say you would only get half of the value? Yeah, we're, we're, right, we're right there. Might so well, yeah. we may as well. Let's go. Might as well do it. Luckily, if I remember correctly, and I'm pretty sure I do. So if they went 300 miles away from the, away from when they did this challenge, their last challenge, they would still get full price. Yeah, within walking distance. Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's right on that square. Sam's kind of cheating though, because he's been here before. It's not cheating. It's like, <laughs> cheating. You know where things are. My memory. I mean, it's kind of perfect. We're not going to get a better incline than that. You're not going to get 100 feet. It's actively dangerous. Oh, it's super dangerous. Would you like me to do it? I don't know. What do you think? I mean, you got really f***ed up on the last one. Hey. hey, hey. You OK? You got it? Can we get some elevation, look for flags? All right, looking for American flags. I don't see any. Oh, great. All right, so it has to go down the incline without falling apart. That's the key. Oh, God. It's going down the incline. That's a big fall apart. Oh, the handle fell off. I did it. It did fall apart. Not the important part. I don't know. In fact, does that count? Yeah, it counts. 
the seat it, hurts it, it so did much. Not. <laughs> it did it over again for no reason. Incredible. All oh right, now God. that we They're got. at the money. All right. Going to Singapore. <laughs> well, that building has a whole lot of security cameras. Oh, 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 oh it's no mirror. There we go. Found it. I got some money. Very Let's class. go. Oh, it's half staff. <laughs> Who died? That's two hundred fifty dollars. Yeah, that was um, super easy. Pretty really work. Not right, bad. Sit down somewhere and strategize. Yeah. There's a bench over there. Should we go to the bench? Yeah, let's do it. We really have not talked much about what we're doing after this point. Because I don't really know what we're doing after this point. It's yes, like legitimately zero idea genuinely, which country we're going yeah, to. Yeah, genuinely, next. I don't know where we're. We don't really go do next. their plan. The other yeah, guys don't have a plan to get themselves. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> India. Screw yep, Yeah, we're gonna get to Asia. I think India is part of Asia, but it's pretty tall. Just, just dump it. We don't need Ciao. it. Ciao. We wanted you back. All right. We check the prices. Have you changed? Let's check the prices. Six ninety-eight. We need ten dollars. We're ten dollars short. Oh. So we can do. We have to do any challenge. Okay, let's decide on one really quick. Found a flight that goes from Amsterdam to Budapest at 125, which is in two hours from now. $190 each. So we could do that. And then there's a flight that leaves at 11.30 p.m. that goes from Budapest to Dubai for only $240. If we do it, it Why gives are us these enough plugs time so cheap? to Budapest to complete a challenge and then get on the flight to Dubai. I mean, it gets in Dubai when? It gets at 7.30 a.m. tomorrow in Dubai. And then, and then the rest of it doesn't start until like 3 p.m. Okay, so we haven't mentioned this yet, but so that nobody dies, the game gets paused for a 20 hour rest period after the first 48 hours. That means we need okay. to be on the ground and in a hotel at 3 p.m. Dubai time. Yeah, so hypothetically, that sort of gives us some time to leave from Dubai or do a challenge in Dubai. Yeah, I mean, it sounds sounds like a good option. And it's not like the best option we have now. We, and might, we have to do it now. We might just have to do it. Because like, if we're going to do it, we have to do it now. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Okay, so we need literally 10 more dollars to book the flight to Singapore. So, so we can just do like. Challenge we just got to get it done before our flight leave. We could go get drunk on a local liquor. We could go do option. we could go do a piggyback ride around a local park. We could go try and find a regional exclusive McDonald's item. Uh -huh. We could try and buy a hat that's worth more than $100. There are lots of clothing boutiques around here. But if we decide on that, we're locked in. That's true. We're locked in. I think we should look look for local parks. Yeah. Let's look for a yeah, park. That's really the safest option. All right. Challenge call the Uber. And uh, I guess I'm going to book that flight while we're in the Uber since it leaves in like exactly two hours. It leaves in exactly two hours from now. Oh no. What? What? Uh, you can't book within two hours. And literally three minutes ago, it came within two no hours. No way. Oh yeah. my god. Worst timing. Wow. So we're literally three minutes late. Oh. Okay. We're going to get an Uber to Parco Mameli. Parco Mameli. Parco Mameli, yeah. Every team, every team made a piggyback ride around the entire perimeter of the park. I'm super park. excited to carry Adam around the park. You don't seem excited. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is beautiful. So for this challenge, we have to give each other piggybacks around the perimeter of the local park. We're here at Parco Mameli. We don't have a lot of time, so we're gonna go as fast as possible. We're allowed to switch off at any point. We just have to get all the way around. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it. We're doing great. I've not seen a lot of good options in Dubai. I mean, we could try Doha. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think Doha has a budget airline like Fly Dubai. It doesn't really, yeah. Uh... Man, I feel like I'm stuck like this. I think it's stuck. <sighs> This is where planning would be really useful. Yep. I know ben and Adam definitely have the advantage. Oh, easy. They do. They already got their light. Oh, you're doing so good. Money. <laughs> all right, all right. Take a break. Take a break. All right, here. Switch. All right, we got it. One, two, three. Ah. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. I guess down bull keeps coming out. The question is, what do we do next? Um, I think just a time lapse. I'm really just trying to find, like, a connection that would work. It feels like there's nothing good. Why are all these flight Dubai flights from sketchy places? Oh, just keep hitting brick walls. We've been doing this for like an hour and frustrating. It's like, don't even have leads. It's getting better. Nice jet planning. 
<laughs> no, no, no. Keep recording. This park is beautiful. It's really lovely. It's a lovely day in Italy. It does look nice. We haven't slept in so long. Oh my god. Are you done? Yeah. Right. Why don't they try to get some sleep on the plane? <sighs> We're not going spectacularly. We just can't find a good route, and we're really burning time while yeah. we're doing it. So, like, it's stressful in a lot of different ways. Yeah. Right now, we're just trying to find good Wi-Fi. There are bats. Almost there. Uh, you okay? You want to? You want to switch? I got it. You got it. <laughs> they okay. did it. Now they have their flight. Whew. Money in the bank. Great work, buddy. Let's get to the airport. Hey, Sam yeah. thinks he's finally found something. Tonight, out of Amsterdam, at 9.25 p.m., there is a non-stop flight to Singapore that would cost $1,604 total Ooh. between the two of us. That's a lot. The rest period um, ends at 3 p.m. Singapore time on Sunday. Sorry, I have tons of tabs. Here's my job. 25 a.m. on Monday from Singapore. There is a non-stop flight to Seoul, which is a country that we can transit through. That is six hundred twenty-nine dollars total and from Seoul. Okay. There is a two forty flight to LAX, would cost two thousand two hundred dollars for the two of us. <laughs> I think this is our best shot. It would just require really grinding with the challenges because we both. I mean, in yeah. order to they need to make tonight, five grand to do that, and prices could change at any moment. We need to earn nine hundred and ninety-eight dollars and eleven cents in the next. Eight hours. Great work. You did it. Thank you. I even got their flight. Five minutes away. We're gonna make it. Eight hours to earn nine hundred dollars. I think that's doable. All right. I it's think we have no other doable. choice. I mean, I just don't you see a better option. All right. You just pick a bunch of like easy, low-level challenges. That way, they get that don't. That might not give you a lot, but you can do them really quickly and. Let's do it. We have to. We have no choice. <laughs> so, got to fly to Singapore tonight. Yeah, let's just start grinding in Amsterdam and fly straight to Singapore tonight. Enrico is right around the corner. We're going to Singapore, baby. Oh, they're going to Singapore. <laughs> I cannot wait for you guys to see what happens in Singapore. Oh, that's going to be intense. They're going to the exact same location. I think it's, the, the first, Ben and Adam, I think, aren't going to be there early, which means their flight's going to be earlier, so they might not actually interact with each other. But that's still crazy they're going to the same location. I mean, this has been a really weird, this is a weird, re really weird series and challenge you'd put yourself through. I don't know why you would do that. Maybe just to do it for fun. I would honestly do it for fun. But I honestly don't know why anyone would put themselves intentionally through that kind of stress, like that hardcore level of stress. But I guess it's all part of the challenge, so it might work out. So if you enjoyed that video, please remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye.